exciting little montage to show you. Look, we're in the Virgin Clubhouse Lounge and you can go outside. There's a garden and there's a nice sunset. Here we are. There's two friends on top. I'm really excited to watch the movies and play food. What are you going to watch? I love playing food. I really want to watch King Richard. Oh, show them, show them what I got you. Did you get me? The best toy in the world. Well, the gadget, not toy. You mean that I bought myself? Oh, no. The garment. Oh! You see, no. Sure, I thought you, I you so no, when you said the best gadget in the world, I just bought myself a garment watch, so I thought that was the no. better gadget. It's a little adapter that you can plug in to your... So you use your earphones. To connect to the plain TV, which is amazing. We are now in Joburg and um, we have to re-check in and we have a five hour layover which is so annoying because it's only like a, a, very, a very short flight to Cape Town, like an hour and a half. Did you guys know that Nando's is actually South African? I had one here and it was very disappointing. Uh, we've got another four hours here. I'm in the lounge and I'm going to have a shower and look how nice this is. I don't want to feel clean because I actually am. I'm on my period and I think I, what well, no, I know I leaked, so I would love a shower actually. Very excited. Oh my god, that's nice. Although showers after a plane journey always are so nice. Look, our first time we're in Africa. It's a little baby, baby, I don't know. We are staying at Casper's friend's Benji's house. We're getting ready quickly to go out for dinner because I really want to catch the sunset, which is at 7 o'clock. I'm vlogging! You want to close that window and get the mosquitoes coming? Yeah, because I thought watching the sunset would be a very nice way to start the holiday. Ahead of Theo's bachelorette party tomorrow. That's actually why we're here, because Theo's getting married, Casper's sister. And I'm going to the bachelorette party tomorrow. Very exciting. I don't know. Oh, I've had a purple shampoo leakage, which I feel like was inevitable. Oh. I'm running very late, so I'm gonna go. But, what? huh? Okay. Yes, I'm just coming. It is a lovely day. The sun is shining. I feel great. I just started my day with a reformer Pilates class. But I'm just gonna show you the view. Look at that. And the air just smells so good. You know, that holiday air. I could live here. Okay, so Theo's bachelorette. Call it a bachelorette party here, not a Hindu. The theme is Irish fairy because Theo is half Irish because Casper's mum, Emily, is Irish. She's half Irish, half English. Anyway. Obviously, because it was Theo's bachelorette party, I didn't exactly want to vlog the whole time, but here is a little look. So we went to a place called Franschuk, which is a wine region, so there's lots of wine farms. They call vineyards wine farms in South Africa, which is cool. Anyway, this is Boschendale, the wine farm we went to on the first day. It was like a three-day thing. Here is me dressed as a Irish berry, as that was the theme. And here is the tree we had lunch under on the first day. Yeah, it was really cute. Okay, bachelorette party is over. It was such a nice time with a group of friends. They all made me feel so welcome. And yeah, it's interesting because I spent like four Christmases with Casper's family now. So I suppose I am like very much part of the family. So it was so nice. I'm going to be very excited for the wedding on the weekend. And now I'm at the beach with Robin. Hi. So Robin is Benji's girlfriend. Okay, you don't know who Benji is, but Benji is one of Casper's best friends and business partners because Casper is basically in business with I most. Love his friends. <laughs> yeah. So Benji and Casper co-founded Proper Living. And Robin quit her job to work for Proper Living. Yeah, job ship. Here's a Proper Living hat. Yeah, wrapping the brand. It's so nice. Um, although the water is actually cold, it is not like the Mediterranean. So I'm going to quickly run in. Yeah! How was that? <sighs> Freezing. It's so nice. Look, it's like Jelly from jellyfish. Look at all the mist as well. What's that from? It's from the, the water. The ocean. Ooh, that's lion's head. It is, isn't it? Yep. We hiked up that the last time I was here. Well, so only in January, because I'd never done it before, even though I've been to Cape Town like, I don't know, three times before that. It's actually a really hard hike. I don't think safety is a big concern in South Africa because there are these bits where you have to climb up like ladders and like these like metal brackets just like in the wall which 
I actually feel quite dangerous because, well, I was very scared. And there are a lot of accidents that happen. I feel like this whole vibe is very LA with like the hills and the palm trees. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh my God, we made it. When you're on camera, you oh do it. Look at the juju, juju of the camera. I almost though. just like um, wheeled down the hill. <laughs> Yeah, Robin stalled like twice, so I thought I would get <laughs> no, the third once, one on camera. Once my, my whole my whole car on a hill like this just didn't. We almost went my heart is straight into the ocean. <laughs> so Robin, I feel like you hate like a lot of things of driving. You're like, I don't like parallel parking. I drive no, on I the can, block. I parallel parked. I've, I've grown up. <laughs> it is another day back in Robin's car. Um, no, rolling down hills this time. We are off to a bar class this morning. I feel like this holiday I've been so active this is our second workout class we went to a reformer pilates class which is really hard um yesterday i went on a 10k run because i'm training for my half marathon got another run to do this week next week i have to it's just it's great i've never been like this on holiday before look at the mountain you just have mountains everywhere here we are in the the southern suburbs is that where we are yeah in claremont, claremont. The place we're going to move the lab is actually where we're doing the bambi cape town event in a few weeks there it is. How cool this is. It's a, yeah, it's a vlogging camera. The microphone is quite cute, isn't it? So First bar class. It was so hard. Um, this is Jess. She is the one that owns the studio and also taught the class. She has so much energy. She did like the whole class with us. Usually trainers will just like show a bit of the movements and then stop. But you just kept going. It was so impressive. We are planning our Bambi proper living and movement lab event. <laughs> Very exciting. Okay, we are at the Proper Living building. Here we are. A couple years ago, Proper Living. This was literally just like flat ground. They completely built this whole thing. Let's give you guys actually. Are you filming? Yeah. So this I'm, is like a It's so cool. They are talking about um, all the things they've learned because they're actually building another one just over there. Okay, now we're going to the gym, which is cool. It's an outdoor gym. What do you do when it rains? Um, gym in the rain. Wait, Will you even reach? Well, I... yeah, no, maybe not. You can't do one. Come on, do the middle ones. That's brilliant. Two? Yeah. Okay, let's see if Ooh, I can do that hurt my abs. I don't know why for a second I thought I might be stronger than you. Have a natural male advantage. Casper's uh, just doing a workout. This is Casper's dad and Lindsay, his stepmom, by the way. Because they're here for the year's wedding. Wow, look at the view. Lion's head. We're seeing a penthouse. So, we're Carl's kindly showing us around his room. Wow. This is so cool. Can you just eat it off the here? Yeah, it's like when we were in Tokyo. There's this kind of sushi here called fashion sandwiches. I've never seen outside of South Africa. But they look like this. Little sandwiches. We're on a road trip! I feel like I'm always next to Robin when I'm yeah, I feel like I've featured quite a lot in this. Robin's not driving today. No, good. Benji's driving. Um, Casper's in the front. Who? Student living. It doesn't Ooh. look as good. No. Uh -huh. no. This is Sasha next to me. Sasha, Casper's cousin. Funnily enough, so Sasha is Casper's business partner. Benji is a business partner of Casper, but another business. And Robin works for Casper. I'd say well, with. Works, I'd say works with. with Barry. Why don't we start a business? I know, I think we will one day. Maybe like. Oh, 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 oh. Wait, can we just talk through that he manages you too? Oh my yeah. god, yes! He's my manager! Casper, you make money out of everyone. <laughs> yeah. Where's it all going? Everyone, everyone makes money out of him. No, I'm trying to think. My mom and I don't have a business. No, she's a director of Megan. No, yeah, she wrote your book! And your sister? Yeah, she she's a copyright. She helps me with copywriting. Your dad? Uh, my dad. My dad is you know my mentor. We just dropped Sasha off at his old place. Look, oh. we're up in the trees. Daddy's villa. That's where we're staying. Coin, coin. They're flipping. They're, very close, anyway. they're flipping coin for the rooms. Front or back? Front. Front. Oh, so we we get the nicer room. It's not much nicer. It's just okay, we, we have an ensuite. Let's have a little look. Look at the, the view. view! Oh my god! <gasps> Casper, look at the bath! Oh, that's pretty cool. You can use it. Do we even have a shower? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we do. Do you want to do it again? It double or nothing? No, yeah. I'm not giving this up now. You we want to square. Oh no! You this definitely had a shower. <laughs> you can use it. Too long for this. But I'm gonna make you wait a little bit longer because I've got some house rules to go over 
and I need you to listen. So even if you are a frequent flyer, take off your headphones and pay attention while I do the safety demonstration. The source of alcohol. The alcohol is very important. Everything's just going wrong with me and this log for you. Uh, yeah. So sort of meh. Tried it on yesterday. I sat in order. Just, me and Robin both had issues with our dresses. I could do well with a nap. Yeah. Should we have a nap? Why do you need a nap? Look how beautiful this now is. Wow. I wish that I could live somewhere where I had this kind of view every day instead of looking at other houses in Clapham. It is the night before the wedding, so we're going for a pizza night with, I think, just like family and I don't know, other people that are close. It is the day of the wedding! It is a beautiful day. Me and Robin started the day by going for a run, which was great. We did like a seven kilometer thing with different intervals. So the wedding isn't till, ooh, isn't till four o'clock, so we've got some time. And take a look at this, look how sweet. Oh, there, you can make that, Casper. So nice. Oh, So nice, so you can sweet. pan while you have a bath. Very nearly ready. As you can see, my dress. I feel like a bad princess. Yes. Just deciding what jewellery to wear. I've got this love Tiffany necklace that Casper got me for my birthday. What do you think, earrings? The ones you have on. These are too simple. There we go. And lipstick. Favourite lipstick. Kate Glossier. Oops, oh God. I'm literally so excited. Your sister's getting married. Well, they're actually already married, but it's the wedding. We are off. Casper yeah. looks very dapper. So does Benji. Benji looks incredible. Robin looks great. Woo! Jesus. Robin. Okay. Damn. Road trip. We are on our way to Theo and Andrew's sibling moon. Theo and Andrew have invited their siblings, so Casper and me and Andrew's sister and her husband to go away with them for a few days after the wedding. Although it's not like we've gone away with them immediately after the wedding. They've mm. been away for a few days on their own. So look how beautiful this is. But the wedding, how would how was the wedding Casper? How what would you what it's really good. It's the best wedding I've ever been to. Casper was great at being MC. You oh, saw some of his um, his speech rehearse his jokes rehearsal and everything. And you know what the audience just they lapped it right up. Oh. You had them eating out the palm of your hand. Really? Honestly. Casper was excellent. He was doing jokes off the cuff. I feel like he was improvising. So let's make this let's make Casper think he did it. <laughs> so this is where we are staying. Casper is getting absolutely soaked by the sprinklers. I don't know why he didn't wait. It's so crazy. <laughs> There's a big <laughs> No, it's still in there. <laughs> Uh, it is a very exciting day this morning because we have the Bambi Cape Town event. So I'm already in my in my workout gear because we are doing a bar class. It's way better. It's just, my own. just setting up. How cool is this sign? Me and Robin designed this last night, but it looks great. Oh my god! How cool! Look at how cute this is! We've got the proper living tote bags, the hat, little wardens for everyone. Also, uh, resistance bands, and Jess has kindly given everyone a coupon code. We have name tags made, which are so cute. Nice. Got a little setup here. We've got bagels coming, which are going to go here. This is very exciting. I'm at the studio. So I thought I would just sit down and chat to you while I do my makeup for this party. Um, well, it's a proper living party, so it's mostly going to be like, well, 18, 19, 20 year olds, even though I'm 23 myself, so I guess I'm not that much older than them. But so as part of proper living's like marketing budget, they do these massive parties at proper living and they're like super exclusive, only proper living residents can go. And I think they get two plus ones each. But yesterday at my Bambi event, which also went so well, it was honestly just, so nice meeting so many girls and I, it makes me so excited about the future of Bambi. I want, 
um, my goal is to just have like different Bambi leaders in different cities that can organise the Bambi events so that I don't have to do I don't have to be there to do all of them. But like there was this one girl who was there. I've gone off on a tangent. There was there was this one girl who was there, and she said that she only moved to Cape Town three weeks ago, and she hadn't met anyone. And so she met some people there, and she they exchanged numbers, and they're gonna hang out. Like how nice is that? Like, okay, makeup is basically done, apart from lipstick. Now, oh, what do I wear? It's like I was like asking my mother, what did kids wear to parties these days? I say kids, like I'm old. <laughs> I'm a little bit older than them. I think I'm just gonna wear this dress because I love it. This is in the fifties. Yep. It has pockets. Ta-da! Yeah, up or down? Actually, Casper always says up. I don't think he likes my hair down. Or well, he much prefers it up. I'm actually quite excited. I think it's very cool what you've done, Casper. Really? I really do. Teenage me, not teenage, but university me. Whoa! I think it was sick. 